Super Mario Odyssey, Bowser's Castle 2. So we came up here, this is the island directly after the island with the store. And I did a couple of things, there's another... Uh, there's like two moons you can get here before you fight these guys. And I decided to cut all that out because I just... I, I want to get to the bosses, I want to get through, you know, this world into the cool parts of the end of the game. But anyway, if you've been keeping track, we have two Brutals left to apparently kill because the other two Brutals we defeated are no longer on the ship. A little bit dark and then we're going to fight both of them here and this will be kind of the next major moon on our way so of course uh, the shop will have a parts that you can buy for 50 gold if you're having a hard time with this but really these brutals are pretty easy this hat guy is definitely the hardest one i think and that's not to say he's particularly insanely hard i just think out of all four brutals he's definitely the hardest uh, the other bomb-haired woman is probably one of the easier ones, so it's not too bad. If you can master the weird motion controls and get Hattie to spin in circles around you, then this guy really isn't too bad, but every time I try to do that, I either flip the hat up or I just flip it forward anyway, so I usually do my best not <laughs> uh, uh, to not do that stupid thing. Uh, this hat guy has a new move, I think it's a new move anyway, where he'll slam down on the ground and then do a whirlwind with all the hats on his head and the length of that whirlwind depends on the amount of hats on his head. One trick for him is really to hit him once to take a hat off of his head and then use your hat to take out one of the hats before you go out and take, uh, knock more hats off of him because that way you won't have the 50 million hats bouncing around the arena as we saw there near the end of that fight. But he's not too hard. Made That one I think took me one or two tries. I cut out a couple of deaths with that stupid guy and then we may have to fight him later with some kind of boss rush mode but no spoilers right now i mean every pretty much every mario game has had some form of boss rush so it should be expected at this point but anyway uh final brutal we're gonna have to fight her now i don't know what her name is exactly but we're gonna have to deal with her hair bombs and if we remember from the first time and did we fight i can't remember how many times we fought him yet i think this is the second time probably is but anyway like with the first time she's gonna fling these bombs at you and if you line yourself up correctly when she stops moving, then you should be able to flee them right back in her face. But if you can't do that, all you have to do is wait for her to get the really big bombs out, swing around until she decides to plant them down somewhere. Try to avoid it, unlike what I was doing there. I was taking a lot of damage with these two boss fights. And then <laughs> you can fling them right back to her and then jump on her head. So I think the next two ones I actually figure out how to fling the bombs back on her earlier cycle because we'll see in a second because she's going to go through her psychotic bombing of Normandy I guess and then uh, make a strange pentagram in the ground so you know, that's not really a pentagram but it is like a pentagon missing one side so does that make it a square? I don't know but anyway it looks like I don't get that one correct either and I think this hits me again too? No, no it didn't, okay. Does this one hit me? No I think I'm good now. Uh, so let's just wait for her to slam those down and then those go right back into her face and we can jump on her a second time then. As with all Mario laws, you're gonna have to hit her for one <laughs> final and third time. And I'm just waiting to see if I do actually get her in a kind of cooler looking hit there. Okay, this time she makes the devil pentagram. And let's see here, just kind of try to avoid the lava balls and nope, that one hit me so I'm getting a little bit worried here because I'm like, really? Both of these brutals got me down to one health? Like, what, what is happening to me? And I think I missed all of them, so yep, oh well. Uh, maybe you'll get used to that before I did. And she's going to send those in a completely weirder direction than I ever expected. We're going to hit them for the final time, jump on her head for the final time, and that'll be it. Pretty much for this video, we're going to go pick up the moon that spawns, which will open up the gateways to the later parts of Bowser's castle. Or, is this Bowser's kingdom? And then I think we're actually at the... Is this the third video? I'm pretty sure this is the third video, so we're going to be... Or is this the second? I don't know, I don't remember. But anyway, we have one or two videos left, and I will see you then. <laughs>